So one of the best things about the Jacobs School is the other people. We do all sorts of um, design projects with like robotics, we have BattleBot competitions, we have submarines, and it's just a real blast to be able to use what I learned in school hands-on to make something for a great project. So I'm on a team that actually launches a balloon satellite, um, which is, it's called a balloon sat or the UCSD balloon sat. It's a high altitude weather balloon that uh, reaches near space, which is about 100,000 feet. That's what NASA classifies as near space. And underneath it, we have a parachute and a payload system. Um, each payload holds um, a certain experiment. It's just a beautiful campus. I'm from San Jose, so, and I've lived there 12 years, so it's really nice to just like, being down in SoCal, like living here, it's, it's been really cool. I like working for Dr. Engler because um, his door is always open in that whenever we have questions, we can just go in and ask him um, and he'd help us. And he'd be willing to come into the lab and show us how to do these techniques um, himself. So we get a lot of one-on-one -on -one training with him. And because of that, I feel like I've learned a lot from this experience, both in terms of how to think like a researcher and the skills that you need to do scientific research. I'm on a team of undergraduate students who are working closely with NASA's computer scientists to redesign their entire search site for the images returned from Mars so that the scientists can use these images to further their knowledge of Mars and also for the general public so that they can see these awesome pictures. When I was a freshman, I got to meet a lot of people. I, I got to like decide oh, which org I want to join and then I got to go to a club and then meet a lot of people. So it's a really good experience. It really helped me to break my shell. I like, I like the ties to industry. One, one of the things that really caught my eye was the team internship program, which I did freshman year, and it was a great, great experience. And then the other thing was when I was, I think it was freshman admit day, and IEEE was out there with this table and they had NAT car. And here was this, this huge jumble of wires and electronics that some guy had built, and I said, well, that's what I want to do. I like the community. Um, I'm, I'm really involved in organizations and I really like being a part of that. So um, I get to meet and hang out with all these cool engineers and I think it's awesome. And the classes are nice and, I mean, they're challenging, of course, but um, I'm, I'm with my friends in them, so that makes it all a lot better. So one of the wilder projects I got to work on within the structural engineering department actually was investigating how whales hear, um, specifically trying to determine the acoustic pathways of beaked whales uh, with Professor Crystal. My graduate student, Dan Kagan, he said, well, you know, day, yada, yada, yada. And I was like, wait, what? He goes, oh, I put your name on the paper. I'm like, oh, that's cool. And inside, I was just like, oh, yes, this is my first paper and everything, so. I was part of uh, grocery shopping assistance uh, for visual impaired um, grozy project. I helped develop the um, glove that would uh, uh, help a visually impaired uh, purchase the items that he wants without, um, you know, more independently. 